Yes. So today we will study about to solve a quadratic equation. Firstly, as I was explaining that to you, that there are three ways to solve a quadratic equation. Fundamentally, you also have to understand that, as you know, also that quadratic equation that will be in a form of a x square plus b x plus c. Okay, where okay. c is your intercept. Okay. Also, I explained okay. that to you in previous classes. That intercept that means the point where the graph will cut the x-axis. Okay. I think I didn't explain you graph about, huh? About graph. No, I don't think so. No, no, no. Okay, means fundamentally that I am telling you. When I'll explain graph to you, then you will also be able to understand much clearly about that. Secondly, that firstly you can solve that quadratic equation by factorization. Secondly, you can also be able to solve the quadratic equation by completing a square method. But as usual, you are in tenth grade. That in this in this one, that you will have to learn about to solve a quadratic equation by quadratic formula. Before starting that, I can tell you uh, uh, manually that uh, quadratic formula that is also known as Sridharacharya formula because Sridharacharya was the mathematician who invented that formula. Okay. Okay. We generally use this formula when the other two methods will fail. Okay, that means when it is not possible to uh, solve a quadratic equation by factorization or by completing a square, then there is a third method. By using this formula, we will be able to solve the quadratic equation. Clear? Okay. So now let's start and let's see that what type of knowledge that is given here. Okay. So using quadratic formula, simple that only one topic that we have we have to study over here. That using the quadratic formula to solve the quadratic equations. So you can see that I am clicking firstly. Okay. Try to factorize it. Um, no. Here you can see that they are saying that try to factorize it. X square plus 5x plus 2. So you have to factorize 2 in such a way so as to get 5. But no, it is not possible. Yeah, because, because 5 is not. Yeah, 1, 2 is a 2, 2 ones are 2, and nothing more than. So it is yeah. not possible. Okay? So okay. in that way, this problem cannot be factorized very easily. Okay. We need to use different method to solve this one. The quadratic formula will help us to find the two values of x that will make equation equals to zero. Okay. Okay. Yes. So, and whatever value of x that you will get, that will be your roots of the equation, okay? Okay. Yeah. So, one more thing that you have to know about. So, here, that there is a quadratic formula, okay? That is yes. x equals to minus b plus minus and root b square minus 4ac by 2a. Okay. In foreign countries, very... Mm -hmm. Few in in few countries that is written in their books that it is also known as Sridharachar formula. Okay, but generally yeah, yeah. Qu quadratic formula or simply the formula that is known as to solve the quadratic equation. So when it will be applicable only and only when you will not be able to solve your quadratic equation by factorization or by completing square method okay yes in your free time or when you will be eager to get the extra knowledge of this one then also i'll explain about that factorization i explain you in your ninth grade okay yes and uh -huh. yeah, you did. completing square method that is the next one which you have to learn about okay if you want to be perfect in mathematics so in that condition that uh, in uh, your free time that uh, when there will be no exam or any else then or when you will be eager to understand that then I'll explain that to you okay yeah so here you can see that your formula is here 
you can also mention the values of means your quadratic equation is there you just have to compare the quadratic equation by general equation that ax square plus bx plus c okay okay ax square plus bx plus okay. c so here clearly okay. you can understand that a a is your coefficient of x square regarding to that you can see that here a equals to 1 okay okay here b that is your 5 b is also the coefficient of x c that is your constant term that is 2 okay and when okay. you will get that value of a b and c then plug in your values in this formula and then simplify that oh, oh. Yes. pardon what happened oh no i thought it like i thought we had to like i thought we had to multiply like the no, 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 we don't have to multiply that beta. I think that you do not understand what I mean to ex explain you. I mean to say, uh, I mean to explain you that uh, your general equation of quadratic that is your ax square plus bx plus c or not. Yes, are you are simply that you have to compare this equation to your given equation. So you can see that coefficient of x square that will be your a or not. Oh, oh, yeah, 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 that will so be. Simply, you can go, you, you can come to your equation. Here, you can see that coefficient of x squared, there is nothing, okay? So, if there is nothing, so you can consider that as 1, okay? Okay. Secondly, coefficient of x, that will be your b. So, here, you can see that coefficient of b, that is your 5 or not? Yes, it is. Oh, and here, coefficient okay. of c... Here, here you can see that there is plus C. So, what is yeah, your constant yeah. term will be there? That will be your C. Okay? So, yes, when you oh, get the value okay. of A, B, and C, then you can plug in these values into your formula. That is quadratic formula. And then you can simplify that and you will get your values of X. Okay? Oh, okay. Two values that you will find over there. Positive and negative. You can ask me there, sir, how you are considering that? We will get two values. First of all, that its maximum power is 2. That's why you can understand that. It's a confirmation, okay? Either there is x equals to 2. So that means you are getting two values of x. If that is x equals to 3, so there will be three values of x. If you will get that x equals to 4, means x to the power 4. So that means there will be quartic formula that will be and that's a uh, then you will get that x four values of x okay oh okay so what i mean to explain you i mean to explain the simple thing that regarding to your given equation that you will be able to understand that uh, how much will be the value of x okay or how okay. many values of x that you can get there if there is a right. linear equation like 3x plus 5 equals to 0 so there you can get only one value okay because the power of x that is one okay yes when there is a x square you can see that power is two so clearly you have to understand that when you will solve this one then you will you can get the value of two values of x okay yeah when, when there will be when there will be power of three then you'll you will get the value three values of x okay okay when there will be four that is quadratic formula you'll get the four values Okay, and onwards. Understand? Yeah, yeah, I understand. Okay, so here, now we can move to the next. Yeah. For example, that the values of A, B, C in the equation 4x square minus x minus 6 are A equals to 4, B equals to minus 1, C equals to minus 6. Clear? Yeah, yeah, clear. A equals to 4. Yeah, now you can see that computer is also assigning values which you can see on your screen. A equals to 4, B equals to minus 1, and C equals to minus 6. Now, the main thing is that if you want to solve this one, 4, 6 are 24. Okay? okay. So you have to factorize 24 in such a way so as to get 1. No, it's not possible. No, we can't. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, we can't do why? that. Why? 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 No, 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 Missy, it doesn't mean that I am saying that it is not possible, then you are saying that it is not possible because I is saying no. That's the common no, 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 way to solve that. 
Yeah, because 24 that you have to factorize firstly that 1 times 24, 2 times 12, 3 times 8, 4 times 6, 6 times 4. Oh yes, no, that is not possible. Oh yes. So, uh, give me one second, I have to connect my charger, please. Okay. So when all the all the two or three methods that will fail, then you can compare your equation with the given equation, general equation to given equation, and then that is the way that when you will be able to understand that one, okay? Okay. Yeah. Yes. So here we can see that when you will get the value of a, b and c then we can uh, do that we can plug in these values into your equation yeah suppose that any other equation also that find two solutions for x okay now in proper way that we will study first of all we have to compare this given equation by your general equation means yeah x square plus bx plus c Clearly, you can understand that coefficient of x square that will be your a, coefficient that is 3, coefficient of x that will be your b, that is your 5, yeah. coefficient of, oh sorry, please, sorry, and a constant value c, that is your 2, okay, yeah, and now you can plug in your, all the three values into your formula, minus b plus minus under b square minus 4ac by 2a. Yes, yes, yeah, you can see that now, you are seeing here that I am plugging the value, okay? Okay. And also then we would like to solve that one. And then, yes, and then under root 1, minus 5, minus 5 plus minus 1 by 6, that you are getting at the last, okay? What does okay. it mean? It means that one time that you have to take that plus 1, okay? Okay. And that means minus 5 plus 1 by 6. So minus 5 plus 1 by 6, you will get that minus 4 by 6. That means minus 2 by 3. That will be your 1 value. Okay? And when you will take that minus 1, then minus 5 minus 1, that will be minus 6. Minus 6 by 6, that you will get 1. Sorry, minus 1. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, so, yeah, because in ninth, my teacher only taught us the quadratic formula, not the, not this method. So, okay. No, no, but uh, whatever your teacher told you, quadratic formula, that is also the same as what you are, I'm explaining over here. Okay. Oh, okay, uh, okay. Yes, uh, that's the same thing that it may be possible that uh, he or she didn't explain that. Uh, in a very detailed manner, what you are in which way that I am explaining that to you. But if if they are explaining about quadratic formula, so quadratic formula that is the same beta throughout the world. Okay, anywhere that you will go, okay, France, Japan, China, United Kingdom, anywhere. Okay, <laughs> okay. yeah, so quadratic formula that is the same. Okay, because okay. most important thing is that, and also that in 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 India, almost. Uh, 99% efficient students or 99% efficient teachers that you will get from India. Why? Means a little bit more laborious that they are Japanese, okay? But according to knowledge, so that means we generally used to study many ways to solve a particular question. If I would like to tell you one important thing that you, I, I think that you wouldn't believe that. I am able to solve a particular question by six types. Yes. Six type? Yeah. I can what solve this one. Yeah, it's a quadratic equation. I can solve this one by graph. I can solve this by quadratic formula. I can solve this by uh, geometry. I can solve this one by quad, uh, calculus. Okay. What? And I can solve this one by statistics. Yeah. You can really well. 
yeah i can solve this one i am repeating my words it's a quadratic equation in a general way i can solve this one by completing a square method okay i can solve this one by quadratic formula i can also solve this one by calculus stream okay that's also mass stream i can solve this one by graph i can solve this equation by statics i'm not talking about a statistic i'm talking about a statics which is a little bit interrelated with physics okay okay and also i can solve this one by dynamics okay oh my god okay yes so beta if you if you would like to study me up to 12th grade or a little bit higher class then you will be masters in your subject especially oh, oh, especially yeah. in mathematics oh, yeah. yes and one more important thing that if you will not intend to get if you will not intend to do job in any school college or anywhere any company okay mm -hmm. then 100% possibility will be if you will get such type of efficiency then uh, i think that uh, you are now uh, i think 14 15 years child okay after yeah, five yeah. or six years okay then you will be ready to get a job or just to earn money and after then it may be possible that suppose that if you would like to spread off your knowledge of mathematics only from your home with the help of your yeah. laptop or mac or ipad okay so simply uh -huh. you just have to sit on one place just like as me and then at that time your monthly income that will be 2 to 3 lakhs oh wow. yeah okay. <laughs> and you don't have to be ready in the morning means a 9 to 6 job and then a little bit of <laughs> traffic and all that no nothing 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 you just have to be you just have to be uh, stable at your place simply just take your laptop and then you just have to exp expand your knowledge you just have to express your knowledge of mathematics to all just like as i am doing to you with you <laughs> okay that is the best way because that most important thing but after 5 or 6 years there will be not a type of job there will be too much competition okay yeah. Yeah, yes yeah, yeah. too much competition in companies and in every sector like government sector private sector okay yeah and also yeah, because, like that because it's yeah. it's it's still going on it's still going on to this day today it's still going on yes 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 May, yeah here means not in india uh, please i am taking few minutes of yours uh, because we are that out of way but a little bit that uh, uh, being of your teacher is uh, my duty to explain you that what is going on around us that here i am seeing some sometimes that i would like to see around me that there are many people who are well educated they they had completed mba mca oh. but they oh. are doing the job of 15 20 means 20 to 30000 rupees only they oh. used to expend at least 12 to 15 hours with respect to their company yes oh and then okay. they are then they are receiving minimum of 20 to 30000 rupees as their salary and always there is a type of sword that would like to be on their neck that <laughs> any time that their job or any time that they can terminate it they can be terminated from their job yes Really? Wow. Yes, yes, that's the true dear. I'm why should I have to tell you lie? No. No, yeah, yeah, no, uh, yeah, but, I don't like it. Yes, <laughs> but but most important thing that suppose that beta if you'll follow me then you are my student and you will never fail in your life. I never feel any type of sword or any type of anything on my neck. No. If you are intent to get deep knowledge then 100% you will come to me 100% you will contact me otherwise <laughs> no problem you are on your place i am on my place doesn't matter of that one okay but knowledge is the most prominent factor in upcoming days beta as usual in our means ancient time 
from our ancient time to till today and in our upcoming future knowledge will be only thing better which cannot which no one can stole which no one can steal yes whatever yeah. that you will have knowledge in your mind that anywhere you would like to go okay no mm -hmm. none of the person would like to share that one is it possible that your father would like to or your mother would like to share what your knowledge that you have at this time no 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 never <laughs> thanks a lot okay so okay. this was a little bit motivation beta that i gave that to you only just to talk for 5 minute regarding to this one only to motivate you beta in such a instance that please and please work hard only education will be there which would like to raise your level yes and then and then if there will be one time will come when you will be in any company that 100% people would like to regard you regarding to your knowledge yes and if you are not working in any company then company would like to hire you in free hold free free states free yeah, states yeah. is the type of condition that means you will be salaried from company but you will be not bound to go there daily yes no. yes yes yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so okay so let's start again beta so here so you can see that so when you would like to get the two values of x you can see that actually from here you can understand are you able to see my moving cursor yeah 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 i can see you yeah you can see that when you get your value of x equals to minus 5 plus minus 1 by 6 so from here that what you have to do so you have to take that two values of 1 over here first the plus 1 that means uh, value will be minus 5 plus 1 okay a little bit just go ahead before okay wait yeah just see here from here you can see that the first one that is minus when you when you will take that plus 1 so your expression would like to be that x equals to minus 5 plus 1 by 6 okay so that will be minus okay. 4 by 6 then you can reduce that to its lowest term that will be it will be So that will be minus two by three. So the first value of x that will be minus two by three. Okay. Yes. So now the next, nextly that you have to take that negative one. So it will be like minus five minus one by six. That is minus six by six. So it will be equals to minus one. So that means now you can see that you are getting the two values of x that is minus two by three or minus one. So also the two values of x will also would like to prove that you did right but please and please don't do wrong calculation okay please oh, yeah, take care of calculation otherwise everything that you know about everything that you did well okay you will do well but if you are your calculation is not good and then you'll get wrong answer so it may be possible that regarding to scaling in mathematics there suppose that it is 3 marks of question Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, it's going to go down. So you would like to get only one marks regarding to your formula if you write right formula, yeah. okay? Right. One. Yeah, marks. that's why. Yeah, that's why I'm a, like, cause sometimes you I know. make, sometimes I make like a uh, little like uh, spell it like um calculation <laughs> okay. mistake. Okay, yeah. okay, I understand that, but huh? okay, how would you like to get that three marks? One marks that will be when you will compare and you would like to assign values of A, B, and C, okay? Okay, second marks yeah. that will be off when you would like to write your formula okay in yeah. right way and the third mark is that one just to plug in the values over there and solve and to get your values of x over there okay okay do you understand what i mean to explain you <laughs> yeah 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 i understand okay that's good so here that means two values that you can see that x equals to minus 2 by 3 and x equals to minus 1 okay so it is yes. the best way to understand that one beta now let's move to the third one third section oh yes so now here practically that i am going to assign you here so here you can see that oh, uh, substitute there is a equation that is 2x square plus 6x plus 2 when you would like to means um, uh, compare this equation by your fundamental equation 
So clearly you can understand that you will get the value of a that is 2, value of b that is 6. So here it will be 6 plus minus b square that is 6 square minus 4 into a. a is your 2 and c that is your 2 again. Clear? Yes. Upon 2a. a is again 2. By different color, oh my god, you can see that computer is also taking the different color as I generally used to explain you by different colors. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so that means A, that is blue one, B, that is a brown, and C, that is a purple one, okay? So that means, yes. means it doesn't matter of colors, only matter is that the coefficient of x, coefficient of x squared, that will be your A, Coefficient of x that is your b and constant term that will be your c. Okay? Yes. Do you understand that? Yeah, 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 I understand. You know what? It's actually very straightforward. Like, it's just. Like, it's <laughs> actually, yeah, actually, Vita, you understand that one. Actually, main thing is that in which way that you are accepting and in which way that I am delivering my knowledge. Yeah, that's the main thing. Many yeah. teachers would like to explain you in a, such a way that so you would like to feel that, oh my God, what a typical <laughs> way it is. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah. but here you can see that of uh, teaching from, uh, I think that uh, from 2005, when I had started online tuition, then online tuition, when I would like to tell any person that I am teaching online through computer, then each and every person would like to quite surprise what you are taking classes through computer yeah because at that time there was a laptop was not in trained means too much training okay normally yeah. office workers or company members they generally used to have laptop but suppose that if i would like to tell anyone that i would like to teach all the students surrounding the world with the help of my laptop so they would like to yeah at that time i was uh, I have, uh, yeah, I have, I have a computer, desktop, but at this yeah. time then I have laptop, <laughs> last uh, seven, eight years, but uh, means at that time that, means what type of knowledge, then from that, from that uh, period, then I started to explain, firstly, there was some time that uh, when I would like to feel a little bit problem of solving few questions, then after taking class that I would like to go through those topics and again I would like to revise all that that what was the factor that's why I was not able to explain at that time okay and then yeah. Vita, from from that period to today now I didn't I don't use to open any type of book suppose that simply you have to tell me about the topic I didn't use any type of book or any type of online book just for practice that I generally used to open book otherwise just <coughs> tell me topic I'll explain verbally to all that to you so what I mean to explain to you here here I want to tell you one thing that practice makes man perfect. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Do. It's a yeah. very common saying. Yeah. Don't ask me that photo. <laughs> Who said this one? <laughs> because I don't know. I think uh, my literature was not <laughs> is not good. I think Shakespeare told this one. Shakespeare? No, no, no. Wait. Uh, give, give me a second. I'm telling you. Give me a second. Hold on. Give me one second. Only one second. Who told practice makes man perfect? Um. Oh, well, I think that uh, I'm searching on Google, but uh, actually, uh, this proverb has been traced back 1550 to 1560. Okay, the latter oh. version, the first attested in the United States in dairy and 
Autobiography of John Adams. Oh, right, John Adams, right. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay. Yeah. So, but I hear that uh, we had plugging the values over there. Yeah. The formula started off 2x square 6x. This, 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 this. That, uh, yeah, b is a plus 6 and so it will be minus b. Yes. That's right. Plus. My, oh, wait a second. Sorry. Here will be minus b. Minus 6. Sorry. Minus oh. 6. Okay. Yeah, I okay. was talking in that condition a little bit. Our mind was destroyed. <coughs> so here, so minus b plus minus. So firstly, we have to solve our bracket, I mean, sir, square root. Okay. Yeah. So 6 is 36 minus 2 to the 4 for the 16. So here we will get 20. Wait, let me show again. 2 to the 4, 4 for the 16, 6 to the 36, yeah, 20. <coughs> <coughs> so 20 beta here you are getting. So square root of 20, you can also assign the value like that. Uh, 4, 5 is a 20. And then you can take uh, 2 outside from, uh, from square root. Then you, you can get there. You can get there 2 root 5. So minus 6 plus minus 2 root 5 divided by 4. Oh yes. Oh, two decimal places they are asking. So 2 under root 5, 2.46. 2.46. A little bit that I am thinking about 2.46 because Okay, we had 2.46, 2.4692 to the 4, 4.92. Uh, okay, in that way. point do you have calculator uh, um, uh, right now no I don't uh, hold on. I think 2.46 that will be 2 to the 4 2.46 2.46 92 4.92 wait a little bit I am predicting value 4.92 divided by 4 let's check that and check the rounding of oh yes I think for 2.93 mm, wait let me take my calculator give me a second I can use my scientific calculator over here yes it is also given there give me one second Yes, because calculator will be allowed to you. So in that condition, it will be much possible for you to do that. Because in America, you belongs to America. So in America's calculator, that is allowed. So is square root of uh, 5. What is happening? Oh my God. Wait, wait, please. Five square root. Oh yes, two point two three six. Oh my God, sorry. Yeah, two point two three. I was telling you. Okay, so two point two three. Uh, yeah, two point two four. You can take. So two point two four. That means uh, four six. That I was taking. Four point four eight. That you can write there. Okay. Four eight. Oh my God, what a... Uh, hold on. Multiplied by 2. 4.4721. Okay, 
4.47 hold on I am writing here 4.47 oh yes oh my god <laughs> computer computer doesn't assign any type of value if there is a little bit mistake under <laughs> under the 10th 100th or 1000th place <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so you can see that better. When you'll get that minus 4 plus minus 4.47 divided by 4. So one time that you will get that your value positive plus 4.47. And secondly, you'll get that value your, your negative. So you will get that. Uh, yes, you can solve this one. And then you can get your value 4.47 minus 6. Okay, just calculate that quickly. Can you calculate that quickly? Minus 6.00 and plus 4.47. Minus 6.00. Minus 6.00. Uh, simply that you can subtract that 6 minus 4.47. Yeah, so that would be 1.53. Uh, 6 minus 4.47 1.53 so it will be minus minus 1.53 divided by 4 I think that uh, your uh, 1.43, I think that uh, approximately that uh, 0 0.4 may become. Um, 0 0.4, let me check that. 1 minus 1.53. divided by 4 equals to oh yes I <laughs> I told you value up to one decimal place but here 0 0.38 so minus 0 0.38 and in the same way here 6 4 10 10 point four seven so in the same way that 10 point four seven divided by 4 okay certainly okay. I think uh, 2.62 it will be minus 2.62 that's market oh yes fantastic very good so it is the best way to understand that how to solve a quadratic equation with the help of quadratic formula beta okay so I think that okay. next section that would like to give you yes now you can tell me what I have to plug in over here Do you, have uh, pen and, do, you have, do you have pen and copy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, firstly tell me what I have to plug in where you are seeing cursor is blinking over there. Okay, so you have to... Minus B. So that will be seven. seven. No. Yes. The seven, seven. Yes, yes, yes. You are right. Perfect, perfect. Because minus sign that will be here and B value that is minus 7. So minus minus so it will be here 7. <coughs> B square that means minus 7 square minus 4 AC that is 3 into 3 minus 7. Okay. Yeah. Upon 2A that is 3. Yep. So now mm -hmm. you have. So how much it will be? So that would be. Uh, that that be forty-seven. I mean, I mean forty-nine plus. Wait, hold on, hold on, just a second. Okay. Two threes are that will be six. And yeah, here you have two seven sevens are forty-nine. Forty-nine that will yeah. be positive, and. Uh, 4, 3 is a 12, 12 is 84, 84 will also be positive, so 84 plus 49, 
84 plus, plus uh, 49, 49 would be, be um, uh, hold on. I think 133. One, the, one, yeah, yeah, 133. Yeah, 133. Yeah, that's right. That's market. Yeah, that's right. So, oh my God. 121, that will be 11. And it is 133. I think 11.7 that can be. Yeah, yeah close to. Are you calculating? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, you can calculate that. Otherwise, I will calculate on a screen beta with the help of calculator. So seven, seven, so one. Eleven point five four. Yeah, yeah, no, it's, yeah, giving, no, it's giving, giving me eleven point five four five four like that. Five four. Okay, five four. You are saying okay. Let's do that. I don't, I don't know if it's right because it's giving me no five four. Let me check that five three. Oh yes, <laughs> that is coming <laughs> five three. Oh my okay. god. Okay. Yes, in this way now you can calculate the seven plus minus eleven plus eleven point five three by six. So eleven seven eighteen. Okay. So six threes are eighteen three point eight forty eight okay? Okay. And it will be seven minus eleven minus four point five three, huh? Four point five three. So zero point Six cents of forty two. Yeah, yeah, because, because you would multiply. Yeah. yeah. Six fives are thirty. Six fives are thirty. So it was seven six. I think that is right. No. Oh, oh my God! Wait a second. <laughs> Wait a second. Eleven seven eighteen. So six threes are eighteen. <clears throat> Oh yes, I forget to include zero over there. And oh yeah, 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 yeah. I was going to say zero. Yes. So zero, and here will be eight. Now it will be oh wait. Hmm. Four point five three. We. Got got uh, no, no, no. <laughs> we are doing that um, means manually in mind. Uh, six threes. So I think I I wrote that right. Zero point seven. Yeah, seven. I think six. That will be maybe. Let's do that. Zero point seven five five. What the matter is? Oh my God! Let me open the calculator. Give me one second. 
Oh my god, sometimes that. You know the problem is what? Problem is not that you was also not seeing there. Problem is that minus will be there. What can I do over here? Oh! <laughs> yes. Do you understand this one? Yeah. Yeah, Miss Beta, I am not doing in uh, means calculation in uh, written, so that's why we are predicting that value. That's why it is taking too much time. But mm -hmm. I hope yeah, you yeah. understand all that, whatever that I explained today to you. Yes. Yeah. So let's. Uh, oh my God. Yes. So I'm giving you a homework over here, okay? Okay. These are the questions, taking a screenshot of this one. And uh, then you have to solve these questions, okay? okay? Okay. Because I don't want to run beta. So today we had understand quadratic formula to solve quadratic equation. So today we have to practice all these type of questions because in your next week that uh, I will take test of this one. To receive that. Uh, um, oh yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay, great. So you have to practice this one. So quadratic formula that uh, I explained that to you. Next one. <coughs> Let me see that what is given online. Homework. Oh yes, the same thing that they are asking here. And uh, plug in the values, substitute the formula, get the values over there. Okay, next is and also, yes, very good. I'm sending another picture to you. Give me one second. Within few hours, Vita, you will be, means not in few hours, I think within one hour that you will be able to see your class on my channel. So are you practicing okay. all the topics which I explained that to you, Vita, related to maths or related to chemistry? Yes, I am practicing, yeah. Yes, yes, Vita, suppose that if you are feeling problem, you can go through the videos and you can see that again and again and again and again, yes. Yeah, yeah. Why, I, why I would like to prefer videos? Because most important thing is that when you would like to see that, then that is an audio visual effect of it. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so suppose you that you are doing your class again. So in that way, it will be much convenient for you. Okay. To understand each and everything. And if still you are feeling problem, then I am here. Okay. You can come in class and yeah. then you can ask that to me. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay, so thanks for today. Have a great time and greetings to your parents. Thank you. Bye bye. All right, thank you, sir. Bye. <laughs>